Hello guys, in this video I will show you how you can read your Max Stripe cards uh, easily. Um, okay, uh, I'm using the card that you can see right here now. It's from MacTech. It's really good looking and uh, it does the job pretty well. Okay, so how you can read it? I made this uh, script. As you can see right here, I'm just doing cut dev std in, and this is the cut. Let me show you. Okay, so you just swipe the card like this. Pop. That's all. And I also, just before a while, I found out that uh, you can swipe the card and uh, display the data inside just anywhere, like here. Okay. That's all. And uh, also, I made this. Uh, let me call it a map of the track one and two. Okay. So at the beginning, we have the sign here, the symbol. It called. It's called the start essential. Then we have the format code, which is B which is for bank and financial and then we have the card number until here okay uh, then we have the symbol it's the field separator the card holder name right here okay one more field separator okay okay and here these four numbers is the expiration date and that's the most interesting, I think. Uh, those three numbers here are called the services code. Okay, the first, the first number is two, so that means uh, that this card has a chip. It's an EMV. So when you go to an ATM and you put your card in, uh, the Max Tribe tells that the ATM also has to check the chip to proceed the transaction okay the second one it's also two here it means transactions uh, are authorized by insurance will be online okay six no restriction on the pin when visible okay and here is the end of the card okay and here uh, I'm not sure but it could be an encrypted CVV, but I'm not sure. Okay, and uh, pretty much here are the same things on track two. Uh, also, uh, I don't know how many years ago uh, the bank cards had also track three, which uh, probably they removed it because it was very insecure. Uh, it was said that they were storing the the pin and there was storing the an encrypted pin so you know what it would happen then For, okay also something else uh, you see the first six digits of your card okay uh, you can check them it's called it's called bin bank identification number okay you can go to this side here bin db and find out oh, where your card from okay so we see that you ha have a problem here go somewhere else
Okay, so as we said, uh, after checking the bin, we found out that this is a MasterCard. No, it starts with five. Uh, okay, it's a prepaid card, anonymous prepaid card. Um, what else? Yeah, that's all. And uh, okay, also if you are interested, 